This meeting of the Rochester Board of Selectmen to order. We have uh, one motion to be made today. Brad, would, do you have a motion to be made? I'd like to make a motion to appoint Robert Small, Chief. I want to thank the great turnout of uh, men in uniform, men and women in uniform uh, from our local towns, neighbors and friends, and everyone from Rochester and any other folks that are here from outstanding towns. For coming to this ceremony. The Board of Selectmen is uh, very excited about uh, our new chief and very happy for our retiring chief. At this time, I'd like to call up Chief of Police, Chief Paul McGee. Thank you. So today is a little bit of an emotional day for me. It's been 31 years uh, in the business. I will try to keep myself together. Uh, not usually an emotional guy. And not usually short for words, but I'm going to be today. Uh, I just want to thank everybody for coming, for the selectmen, town administrator, town clerk, thank you. Uh, members of the area departments for coming to support Bob. Uh, by all means, the troops. You can see Bob has the support uh, of the agency. He's going to make a fantastic chief. And uh, my, my words will be to Bob. Uh, a couple of years ago, I let you know that I was going to retire. And you stepped forward and said, ah, I'd love to give it a shot. I think it might be for me. Uh, I cannot tell you folks the countless hours and the dedication Bob put in from that point forward to the department. Hundreds and hundreds of his own hours to learn the job, to learn budgeting and all the things that we did, meetings, classes. Uh, as I stepped away, took control of the department for the last two months while I've been away. Uh, Bob has just done a fantastic job. This is a tribute that you're going to be a great chief. I could not be more proud and I could not be more comfortable uh, to step away and leave the department to you. So I wish you the best. I tell you, please remember where you came from. Don't ever forget what it was to be a patrolman. And when you make your decisions, make them for the right reason and stick to them. I wish you the best, Bob. Constitution of the United States and to protect and serve the residents of the town of Rochester. Protect and serve the residents of the town of Rochester. Honestly. Honestly. Impartially. Impartially. And to the best of your ability. And to the best of my ability. Please it! Rochester Police Department for 21 years and I still love my job. I get up to work every day with a purpose. Uh, you know, I know, I'm sorry, <laughs> I know that what we do matters and that we have an impact on the community and I'm excited to have the opportunity to continue that uh, and the relationship with the, the challenge of building upon that relationship with the community. But I just want to thank everyone who's come here today. Uh, a lot of people in the community and area departments, area chiefs uh, have been very supportive and offered me a lot of their advice and experience and uh, it's really, really been helpful and I'm thankful for that. I'd like to thank uh, everyone who's given me the opportunity to succeed in my career. Uh, many people from Town Hall have helped give me advice, uh, pointers have saved me immense amounts of time. Uh, I'd like to thank the Town Administrator and the Board of Selectmen for having the confidence in our rank structure and in my personal ability to fulfill the duties of the Chief of Police. 
Um, <clears throat> like to thank the townspeople in general for being very supportive of the police department um, and all first responders. Um, many people have approached me in town and been very supportive and said many nice things about the police department. Uh, I intend to keep that the case. Uh, and I'd also like to thank the members of this department for their support and encouragement during this promotional process, um, but more so for what you guys do every day. Uh, a lot of people may not necessarily see it, but we have a lot of officers that go above and beyond what's required of them uh, just in their, in their job descriptions. They do much, much more than that. And it makes me uh, proud to be a member of this department and this profession. Um, and finally, finally, I would like to thank my family for not only being understanding uh, of, of all the times that I have uh, maybe missed events or had interruptions to phone calls or, or having to leave, but um, they've been genuinely supportive and uh, they've been understanding that it's part of my job and uh, it's continued to encourage me to work as I always have and that's uh, really meant a lot to me and I really appreciate it and I'm going to continue to work the way I've always worked.